Olsen in to try to finish this up, except Olsen hammers that pitch. Oh, actually, we'll go to the sixth, I beg your pardon, with Justin Rowe. Justin Rowe's second home run this season against LSU. Yeah, Justin Rowe, big swing right there. So it ties it up for Carolina. And then LSU would come back, and this is when the crowd really got into it, too. 2-2 Two -two game. Watch this play at the plate. Yes. Now, Antoine Duplantis was called out. But if you watch every angle, look at how he kind of goes swim move with his left arm and avoids the tag. And gets the plate. And barely gets the plate. They review it. They change the call correctly. It, it is hard to explain wow. how good that slide is. Comes from a track-based family and, and really moved in a way that you don't see too many move and ended up making a huge difference in this game. And then LT Tolbert over the head of Zach Watson. Tolbert all the way to third. Gamecocks with the tying run on, and that's when Olsen steps up. I jumped the gun earlier. You're going to have to forgive me. I was ready for more baseball. We're going to have it. Olsen delivers. Tolbert scores. 3-3. Let's go to extras. Remember, that was off Todd Peterson. 12th inning. Daniel Cabrera up. Two for six day for him. LSU up 4-3. Freshman just keeps on getting better. Daniel Cabrera, as this season has gone on, has come up with huge hits for LSU. But because yes. of a move made to put Austin Bain in the field after he came off the mound, they had no DH. That meant Todd Peterson had to play, had to go to the plate first career at bat is a double off the wall you can't be serious this is the greatest this is the greatest and his swing looked hitterish i mean it looked yes. like he had done that before and he looked pretty comfortable <laughs> standing on second base too. and then he comes in gives up one run but ends up recording the yeah. win the arm two rbi double in his first career ab and then there was really just mass confusion after that that was exciting what a ball game i mean that team competed we competed you know, I, I can't say anything more. That was that was a ball game right there. What was your mindset when you stepped in the batter's box? Go yard. I mean, <laughs> I'm a pitcher. Why not swing as hard as I can? I got nothing to lose. And I told him, don't swing. Just go up there and stand there and don't get hurt. You're still in the game. And then it changed the pitch, and I was like, he's getting scared out there. He's like, yeah, did you ever hit an ice school? I go, I, I, I hit bombs. He's like, all right, I'll swing away. <laughs> Uh, and I said, well, you go ahead and swing then. You want the batting gloves? He goes, nah, I don't need them. No. Old school. Old Why school. Not? Got the stirrups on, no batting gloves. Okay. Oh, wow. All right. So I want to hear this. Todd, no, we got to hear from Dad, right? Yeah, because, Dad, sure. is it true? Because was he that good of a hitter in high school? Uh, he, had, he had a few bombs. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. We, we solved that. Todd, when's the last time you've had an at-bat in a competitive baseball game? Uh, high school, I guess. <laughs> Coach, I'll be honest, I didn't hit in high school. My coach what? Didn't let me. You know, I hit BP a couple times. You know, I did hit nukes, I'll tell you that. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah. You didn't even hit in the games in high school? No. Oh he wouldn't let me. Boy. He didn't want to get hurt, you know, but I guess it paid off. All the so you practice. lied to me? Coach, I, I wanted to swing. <laughs> I had to. <laughs> Thank you for lying to me, Todd. <laughs> well, <laughs> How yes, yes, beautiful yes, is that? Yes, yes. That's that incredible. Perfect. That's Did you remember the whole tournament? He goes, You didn't hit in high school? He's like, Well, I hit nukes in BP. <laughs> <laughs> but you didn't actually hit in a game. And I, no, no. And he no, said, Thank you for lying to me. Oh, that was so good. How I good mean, is it? And he, he carried it on for a while. And then his dad even carried it on. His, his dad, dad had to back the boy up. <laughs> this is beautiful. And, and you know what? Um, like that honest reaction you got from Peterson when he came in, when, when they were talking to him after the game. Um, that's what you want from a closer. It's like this just, I don't care. Nolan Hoffman is the exact same way for Texas a and just a minute. I don't care. I don't care about the surroundings. I don't really care what anybody else thinks. Todd Peterson went five innings tonight. That's their closer. And they needed him to go that far tonight. And, and, then, and then he did this. And it sounds like he hasn't done this since he was 12. Um, he just about hit the ball out, man. I mean, yeah. he used to jack by about four feet right yeah. there. He looked the part. I love it. He's kind of making it fun of himself, too. No batting gloves. I got stirrups on. Just grab a bat that happens to be the closest one and end up taking the most important swing of the entire game. And you cannot have a dugout go more crazy yeah. than that situation yeah. right there where nobody expected that to happen. And it again, was a blast. this is because Bain moved to first they base. Lost DH. They lost the DH right. position. Pitcher had to hit. He lies to his coach, he swings away, and he's the story of this tournament. Did you hear pulmonary? Thank you for thank lying, you for to, lying me. to me. Yeah. Now, I don't know if he's <laughs> going to say that again, but thank you for <laughs> lying to me in that spot, is and then this, don't do it again. Is there more? I mean, it, this is just so LSU. Like, right? I mean, it, yeah. if there's one team yeah. in this field, you're going to say that this – if I told you 
A closer comes in. He has to hit for the first time in his career. He ends up sending a two-run double off the wall. He ends up getting a win. If what team would That's you guess that would be? Pick. That would be the team. Well, here. Here, I mean, for, right. for whatever reason, when they show up here, stuff, <laughs> that, it just stuff happens that you haven't yeah. seen happen, and it continues to happen for LSU. Look at the teams that, that played really well today. I mean, it was more than just those two, but yeah. LSU who came into this tournament, we're not sure if they're going to make it. A&M comes into this tournament, we're not sure if they're going to make it. You can cross that off both lists right now yeah, because no both have looked apart here. Absolutely. All right, let's go to A&M. Speaking of them, take